Hundreds of people are expected to visit the old Santa Barbara Mission this Easter Sunday. Visitors from all over the world have traveled to this historic gem for two centuries. News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti takes us on an exclusive tour tonight to show us work being done to preserve the old mission for another 200 years. Known as the Queen of the Missions, the bells of Old Mission Santa Barbara have echoed throughout the region since the Franciscans founded it in 1786 on the feast day of Santa Barbara. The Old Mission is an architectural landmark in Santa Barbara County for sure, and it's outstanding among missions in California because of its neoclassical architecture and its two matching towers. Tucked in the hills of Santa Barbara, facing the Pacific Ocean, visitors have made the pilgrimage for hundreds of years to witness this historic structure. From Arab countries, European countries, Asian countries, African, every place, everyone comes through here. The mission has endured some of Santa Barbara's most horrific natural disasters, including the 1925 earthquake. The 6.3 magnitude earthquake toppled both bell towers and destroyed much of the mission. The mission's foundation held fast, allowing the structure to be restored by 1927. Now, nearly a hundred years later, the need for restoration at the old mission remains a top priority. I'm excited to be in a place where there is movement connecting our past with our present and sort of opening a way into the future. Inside the mission, the restored station of the cross paintings are now illuminated to showcase their vibrant colors. The original mission tabernacle has returned to the front of the altar. In the front of the mission, one of the largest projects is in the works to allow easier access for all visitors. I'm starting right about here with an ADA approved grade going up toward the wall there so that people can get into the church quite easily. Friars at the mission say, despite all these changes, their commitment to preserving the mission is constant. And we're making a statement for the future that we were here and we cared enough to say to the future, we cared, you do the same. As the mission continues its projects, administrators believe community support is key to making it happen. These things are very expensive. Community donations are welcome and very helpful. It will be hundreds of thousands of dollars. The newly planted Monarch Butterfly Way Station, adjacent to the historic Olive Garden Pathway, is maintained by parishioners. Last year, a Chumash Memorial Bear Sculpture was installed in the Old Mission Cemetery to commemorate the nearly 4,000 baptized Chumash people living in Santa Barbara during the Franciscans' missionization of the region. Coming together as people from all kinds of different backgrounds, saying, yeah, this is part of our past and we're making a statement that we care about our past and our past carries us into the future. For many, Easter is the promise of a new beginning. My hope is we can be a new beacon of hope and healing. If that's happening, man, my heart is singing. At the Old Mission Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti.